Hello guys, now is the perfect moment to escape reality and embark on the trendiest ice skate experiences of 2024. Get ready as we've ranked the top 10 amazing new ice skate anime. This list contains stuff for every ice skate fan. From resurrected heroes with OP talents to regular people thrown into magical worlds. We'll discuss heart-wrenching betrayals, amusing miscommunications, epic fights, and perhaps even a few ice skate ice skate. Now, everyone, the gate is open. Let's begin with the number 10 on the list. Number 10, we have, my instant death ability is so overpowered. In this anime, we meet Mondo, a person who seems normal on the outside, but who has a deadly touch hidden away. Tasked with navigating a world where even the slightest unintentional touch brings dire consequences, Mondo tries to conceal and maintain control over his gift. In the meanwhile, he meets a group of eccentric people, such as a ruthless killer who has a like for candy and an enigmatic group that has ulterior motives for Mondo's exceptional ability. The journey Mondo takes to learn to live with his superpower, negotiate the pitfalls of love, and understand the true meaning of strength is sure to be both humorous and endearing. Number 9, we have Suki ga Michibiku Aisuke Dushu. Misumi Makoto, a high school student called to another world as a hero, is dealt a crushing blow when the goddess declares him useless and banishes him to the desolate wilderness on the western edge of the world. Nevertheless, Makoto doesn't give up. He befriends the kind, shun demon girl Mio, and makes a promise to create a haven in the wasteland. He finds hidden talents for taming monsters and crafting, converting the desolate land into a thriving community. Makoto's kindness wins him the respect of expelled demi-humans and monsters, who swarm to his side, creating a bustling, multiracial town. However, whispers of his success reach the goddess, who dispatches assassins and challenges to test his resiliency. Makoto, with his inventive mind and newfound ally. Number 8. We have the wrong way to use healing magic. We get to know Kinji, a youthful knight with an unusual gift for magic healing. Regretfully, his magic isn't precisely standard. Rather than healing wounds, it increases the recipient's physical prowess, frequently with amusing and terrible results. Despite possessing unusual abilities, Kinji enlists in the esteemed Knight Templar and sets off on a number of missions. Throughout the journey, he utilizes his special ability to defeat fire-breathing dragons, unintentionally transform a princess into a muscular warrior, and tame marauding goblins, a humorous adventure comedy. This anime parodies classic fantasy Klitsch S. Kinji's foolish attempts at bravery, along with his capricious magic, create a hilarious scene. Number 7, Tales of Wedding Rings. Sato is dealt a curveball by fate. Haim, his closest friend, is carried off to a different world and is destined to become a ring princess. Sato, though, is no helpless romantic. He interrupts the nuptials, wins a royal kiss, and then boom, he is obligated to Haim by the laws of the mythical realm which makes him the improbable ring king a valiant warrior who must always be by her side. Our high school hero is currently enmeshed in a maze of magical creatures, royal intrigues, and, of course, difficulties of saving the planet. Is Sato able to meet the challenge? Tales of Wedding Rings welcomes you to explore its fantastical world if you're craving an anime adventure that's full of magic, humor, and a dash of fate. Expect laughs, surprises, and possibly even a tantrum or two as Sato demonstrates that even a normal guys can wear crowns. Number 6, we have Ashura. It's a symphony of action, mystery, and steadfast conviction in which a cane struggle for independence. The anime immerses you in a realm glistening with red from insurrection. A cane, a young woman, emerges as a glimmer of defiance amidst the ruins of an old empire, where gods coexist with humans. Tormented by the destruction of her community and labeled a heretic by the tyrannical divine authority, she possesses the forbidden power Ashura, which has the ability to break the connections that separate gods and humans. A cane's unwavering will draws together a group of shunned allies in their desperate attempt to discover the mysteries of Ashura and depose the despotic gods. They travel through a dangerous region abounding with hideous creatures and fervent inquisitors. Get ready for a treacherous journey where treachery could appear at any time and ancient forces engaged in close combat. Number 5, we have Floppy Paradise, a shy office worker who has been mysteriously transported to this bizarre world. Now, he's surrounded by cuddly giants like the joyful bear Kuma-san, 
the wise-cracking alpaca alpacaso, and the ever-hungry panda panpan. It's a heartwarming tale about finding your place in the world. No matter how unusual it may be, Pip learns to embrace his own awkwardness and discovers the strength in unexpected friendships. Cozy up for a journey filled with laughter, giant hugs, and the occasional existential crisis in a world where love comes in all shapes and sizes especially the super-sized ones. Number 4. Villainous Level 99 after being reborn into the universe of her preferred Otome game, Yumiela finds out the awful truth, she is the villain and the final boss. She grinds like a champion and reaches level 99 before even starting school, driven to defy her fate. Now, incredibly powerful yet inept in social situations, Yumiela has to negotiate a world that anticipates her villainy. She fights with the heroines, avoids being captured, and even unintentionally wins over the male protagonists all the while attempting to persuade everyone that she is misinterpreted and not meant to end the planet. A funny mix of self-deprecating comedy, Otome gaming cliches, and role-playing components awaits you. The humorous story Villainous Level 99 follows a misunderstood powerhouse as she attempts to change the story to show that there is more to a villainous than meets the eye. Number 3, Seventh Time Loop The Villainous Enjoys a Carefree Life that's quite a long title. Well, Rish isn't your usual evil woman. She has been reincarnated seven times and has given up big plans for fluffy pastries and beaches to lounge on. Just a little drama, she kept repeating her failed engagement like a damned alarm clock. But this time, Prince Azel, the one who killed her every time in previous lifetimes proposes. Rish accepts, determined to avoid engagement as well as doom. There are unexpected pleasures, royal gossip, supernatural swordplay, and a surprisingly tasty harem of princely suitors in the opposing kingdom. However, there is a hint of political intrigue and betrayal in the air. Can Rish escape her predetermined demise, end the cycle, and perhaps even find love beneath the glistening chandeliers of the Crimson Court? Number 2, Kanasuba, Shud and gamer Kazuma Sada dies a comically unceremonious death and is reborn in a magical realm. The worthless goddess Aqua is the one he selects as his one-sheet item. I apologize. Megumin, an explosion-obsessed archmage, and Darkness, a masochistic crusader, join their dysfunctional group. As they falter through missions, fight creatures, and deplete Kazuma's resources and sanity, hilarious mayhem breaks out. Kanasuba is a hilarious journey that mocks Aisuke Klitsch S with a lovely blend of humor and unexpectedly touching moments. Finally, the weakest tamer began a journey to pick up trash. Ivy, shunned due to her starless tame status, finds comfort in Sora, a humble slime. Ivy, unable to control strong animals, sets out on an unusual quest clearing up trash. Equipped with a battered backpack and resolute determination, she searches the realm, converting contaminated terrain into vivid mosaics of restored splendor. Initially treated with mockery, her path gradually becomes an inspiration to others. Initially disdainful, the villagers now support her cause, their combined efforts creating a fabric of environmental awareness. Ivy's spirit starts a revolution as mountains of trash transform into thriving meadows, demonstrating that even the weakest can bring about amazing change. Ivy, who is rejected as a starless tamer, her story, which demonstrates the strength of selfless deeds and an unwavering spirit, encourages a kingdom to welcome a cleaner, more promising future. Hope you enjoyed the video, if you did please do show us love by subscribing, sharing, commenting and liking the video, don't forget to click on the video on the screen, see you over there, Aragachua. Listen to the nose, I just wanna keep moving, yeah I put out all the